I'm working on something interesting for the iNav 8. It will not be available in the iNav 7 yet, but with the iNav 8, you will be able to see something like that, which basically will be, which basically turns uh, iNav configurator into ground. Uh, ground station control uh, software. Not fully, not like fully blown out like, for example, I don't know, everything that you use, uh, Arduino Pilot uses, but uh, we, you will be able to see the position uh, on the mat with the LTM uh, protocol and you will no longer need an a dedicated software to have some interesting navigation features. This is the quick recording of uh, some of my flights I took today with this uh, software. It's not perfect. It's like you see the, the voltage is completely bonkers because the voltage says it's 240 volts and the speed is 600 meters per second then that would be one fast drone as you can see we have uh, some progress and uh, it's actually pretty nice by the way uh, for now it will be using the for uh, for sure it will be using the LTM uh, protocol and if you have the somewhere like express LRS uh, hardware laying around you will be able to use the A report to basically get the direct telemetry downlink from your from your UAV and observe how you go, how you go, how you fly, and even have some later, of course, have some uh, extra features uh, available on the map. This is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. This is something I'm working on for the last few weeks. So far, it's looking good. INAF 8 will get something uh, like this, and hopefully that will close a gap, because uh, since a few years, there is only basically one ground station software that is uh, INAF compatible. And this is the MWP tools developed by Stronach. By the way, Stronach also helps to uh, build INAF. Stronach's MWP tools is available only on the Linux. And uh, majority still of the, of the laptops and, and, and the hardware you, you use basically on the fields is not Linux. But it's Windows and setting this time this thing on Windows even with the WSL is somehow like a problematic endeavor. So, but an INAF configurator is everywhere. So hopefully having the ability to see where you are flying uh, will be just uh, out of the box with the INAF configurator. And I think that that will basically close one of the feature gaps that uh, INAF has comparing to the Arduino Pilot.